Welcome back, folks. This is the International Championship match. No one in the entire locker room, I, 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 no one in the, even the front office, as I was told during that short break, knows who X is set up for Cathal. Cathal, he's got to be in a dilemma here. He has no way to prepare for his opponent here tonight. He has no idea who he will be facing. And quite frankly, folks, knowing X, it may not even be someone in VCW. He may have rec recruited someone from the old SWF. And Cathal was a part of SWF. But will he be able to prepare enough for this competitor that he has no idea who he is? We know Cathal is intense. We know Cathal can take on anybody. But will he be able to take on a mystery opponent? But who will it be? Who will be that mystery opponent? And you see Cathal staring down the ramp. He's wondering as much as we are. Who will this man be? And you see the shot of these fans. Who will it be? Who will this mystery... No. You've got to be kidding me. X is a bastard. X is making his return to the ring. He's in ring gear. He has to be the opponent for Cthul. You have to be. Oh my god. Can't be an attack backstage. Has opened the door for X. And X has made himself the challenger in this match. God damn it. Just as when we thought could, that X was turning over a new lead and had respect for these for the roster and these people in the crowd. Kent comes up attacked and X is the new challenger for the international championship. How fucking God convenient is that? X is now going to face Cthul for a title that he has had the chance at, but Thor and Black beat him for it in the inaugural episode of BCW. God damn it. Executor is the number one contender now, I guess you can say, for the international championship. Dude, to Kent being attacked, and you can't see it at home, but I'm using quotations backstage. This is just a damn shame. And that's what it's all about, folks. Cathal's in international championship. And you know he's going to fight his heart out to defeat Axe here tonight. That corrupt bastard. God damn it, Axe. And here we go. And Cathal starting this off with a big forearm shot, but Axe able to get in some on his own. And Cathal, he has no way to prepare for X. He's never faced X outside of SWF. That was nearly two years ago. God damn it. X with a backbreaker on the Mad Monk. X going to the top rope. And a moonsault on Cathal. God damn it. I still can't believe this. And no, no, thank God. Cathal has to retain here tonight. Going underneath the legs of Cathal again. Cathal doesn't know what to do. Axe is part technical, part, excuse me, part high flyer, and part powerhouse. There's no way to prepare for a man like this on a, on a 15 seconds walking down the ramp. And this is not right, and Axe gets the neck breaker in on Cathal. But if I know Cathal, he's going to fight his heart out. And he's going to bleed. He's going to fight. He's going to scratch. He's going to claw to hold on to that championship. And X now going for Roller. Come on, Cathal. Come on. Not even before a one count. Cathal being able to kick out. Thank God. Cathal with the side headlock on Executor and a big punch to the skull. And Cathal with a big knee straight to the crotch. Now Cathal, wrist lock on referee James Cameron. Big European uppercut by Executor. And he's trying to roll up, up again. Executor wants to end this as quickly as possible and only a one count. The one thing that I think Cathal has an advantage of is power and submission game. Cathal is a master of submissions. X is not. And Cathal with a big power slam, only able to get a one count. If that... And these fans 
way really behind Cathal, letting him know what they think. He's insane, and they know it. The Mad Monk is going to be out for blood against a corrupt general manager. X being pinned now. Oh, no, not even a one count. Cathal perhaps underestimating Executor. He hasn't been in the ring in nearly... What is it? We debuted in February. He hasn't been in the ring since about since the first episode so he hasn't been in ring for over a year and now executor with a wrist lock will there be ring rust thus far there are none Cathal has been wrestling weekly and he goes for this crucifix pin well, only a one count and a big drop kick straight to the jaw of Cathal both men go for a drop kick, but I believe Cathal was able to connect with his. Abdominal stretch by Executor. Abdominal stretch by Executor. That corrupt son of a bitch trying to make Cathal tap out. But no, Cathal has a reversal for almost every submission that you can try to put on him. And he's going for one of his own. He's going for a Boston Crab. The referee to a count of five, and I believe Cathal is going to utilize all of it. No, he only goes to two. Executor with a big kick to the abdomen. Oh my god, dropping the back straight on his knee. And Executor going to the top rope. And Cathal able to kip up. Cathal hits him in midair. Cathal lifting up Executor. Oh my god. Gift of pain. The last gift of pain, perhaps. Gift of pain by Cathal. Gift of pain. Gift of pain. It's over. It's over. One. Two. Oh my god. Executor somehow able to kick out of the gift of pain. Big neck breaker on Executor by Cathal. God damn it. What does Cathal have to do to put him away? Driving the knee into the back of Executor. And Executor about to... No. Cathal just lets him out. God. <sighs> Dropping the elbow straight across the bridge of the nose. And he's going to do it again. And he does. Going for the pin now. After two elbows to the bridge of the nose. Only a one count. What does Cathal have to do to put Executor away? That is perhaps what is going through the mind of the international champion. And he just got dropped on the knee of Executor. Collar elbow tie up, but Cathal able to reverse into a side headlock and a punch straight to the face. Big clothesline by X on Cathal. Executor wrist lock on Cathal, but Cathal able to reverse it. Got a wrist, uh, rear waist lock and an elbow to the back. I am just so frustrated by this matchup, folks. It should have been Kent versus Cathal, a match that we've been hyping for months now. Instead, Executor puts himself in the place of the injured. Again, quotations went up in the air, Kent. And we have to remember that Executor has a trust with Kent. Kent was, when Kent debuted in VCW, he was the apprentice of the general manager and now I guess in-ring competitor, Executor. And Executor gets a big, big forearm shot to the skull. And again, but Executor not falling. This time he does. And Tigabudula is now online somewhere in the world. Side headlock. And Executor going for that clothesline again. But Cathal able to get out of it, but it gets a neck breaker instead. Cathal with a big forearm shot straight to the skull. Lifting up X, Irish whipping him into that corner. Going high, superplex perhaps, is he going to go for it? Yes, and he hits it on the general manager, Executor. The best damn thing since electricity, according to him. One, oh, only a one count on X. What does Cathal have to do to put away the general manager? Are those thoughts creeping into the head of the international champion now that we are about eight minutes or seven minutes into this contest? And now he's driving that knee into the back again, but does not get the submission. 
And X going outside the ring again, escaping from the Mad Monk. And the Mad Monk greets him with some punches straight to the face. And again, another blow straight to the face. Shut up, I know you're laughing at home. <sighs> Cathal lifting up Executor. Fisherman suplex. And will that be all? Will that be all? Will the Fisherman suplex put away Executor as Cathal goes for the pin? One. Two. Oh my god, only one and three quarters. Cathal can't even get a two count at this point. And two big kicks by Executor sends down the Mad Monk Cathal. And a big clothesline knocking down our general manager, the self-proclaimed best damn thing since electricity. And now TG Belugia has left the crowd because he doesn't like this content. And he's probably outraged by Executor being in the ring right now. And Executor gets a very big neck breaker. And he's going outside the ring. What is he going to get? What is Executor going to get? James Cameron is down. Executor going for a chair, perhaps. And yes, he pulls one out. Oh, and Cathal knocks down Executor. Cathal has a chair, but Executor able to drop kick him. And now referee James Cameron is up. Referee James Cameron is up. Executor. Oh my god, that skull crashes right on top of Cathal. And folks, we'll be right back. You know you want to see this exciting contest. Who will be the international champion? Will it be the best damn thing since Electricity, Executor, or the Mad Monk Cathal? I am Scott Harris. I'll always love you, bitches.